Alright, welcome to part 4. I actually already recorded a bit of this, just to have my mic uh, troll a me, and be like, Oh, your sound device isn't working, blah blah blah, even though everything's plugged in and not broken, and it was great. But um, luckily I was kind of having a bad run anyways, because I said at the beginning of the part that I, um, I hope this isn't as, uh, you know, strenuous as yesterday, um, where I recorded part three and Tanya would constantly stop just to, um, you know, want to get killed by zombies, even though I gave her the best gun in the game. Um, whereas normally, you know, since all AIs seem to do that, I can, you know, fight off the zombies and help them, but I had to rescue Pamela, who was a mess, and she wanted to die, so she did. And, um, that was cool. And, yeah, I'm just hoping I can, uh, have a bit of a more successful day, though that wasn't bad. I, that was the only survivor I messed up on. And, yeah, the cultists are everywhere. And, I guess it's just best not to try to fuck with them too much, because, um, they will grab and strip you of all your clothing items except underwear and um okay fucking <laughs> what yeah oh my god I'm fucking out of here yeah I, I like the cartoonish face flops um, I should do girl hunting, I'm going to do above the law, and I clicked the wrong one, and I don't care because there are a bunch of weeaboos over here, and not only are they harder, but like I said, they can grab you, and fucking make you unconscious, strip you of everything you have, and, um, basically fuck you up to the point where you either die, or escape with, like, nothing, and it just, it's not good. So, um, I have no idea why there are... Oh, okay, those are stairs. I was gonna say, I have no idea why there are three bathrooms, but, you know, not three bathrooms. Fucking stairs, you know, why there gotta be stairs there, one? I don't know. So, yeah, we are going to do Above the Law, and I need to get another chainsaw. And there should be a criminal whatever book. Intent? Criminal intent? I don't know. <clears throat> that will make the chainsaws even more durable, which is really nice. Of course, it'd be better if I had more inventory spaces, but what can you do? Now, just because I, um, you know, already went through the trouble of getting this, I know it's right here. And I'm going to drop the skateboard. And, um, there is a health book here, but I'm not gonna get that just because of lack of inventory space, though it is really useful. And we're gonna go see about that cop dragging a woman into a store over here. Maybe she, uh... I can hear cries. Maybe she rescued the young gal. Maybe she's a corrupt cop. Hmm. The world may never know. Could have sworn I saw one with a bee. None of these have bees, they're not like fumbling with the air, grabbing the air, okay. And yes, these two are a um pretty ridiculous sight. I'm gonna photograph them. Oh, okay. I apparently already got the PP stickers that didn't do anything. I'm not gonna worry about them. I'm gonna look at what is um up with this uh cop. And I forgot to get the other chainsaw, so I'm gonna go do that really quick. This is the most hacked staircase I have ever seen in my life. Oh, 
Um. Are the queens gone? Alright. I got a queen. That should help with clearing those zombies with those people on the giant rabbit. And I have another chainsaw, so that's really good too. Now let's see what's going on with this cop. What have we here? Looks like you lured another man in here, you little whore! No, I didn't. Uh, please, help me! Let's see just how shameless you are, you dirty little skank! Say hello to my little friend! Uh, no, not again! Help me! Um, officer. Officer, can I talk to you for a minute? I mean, uh... Look, what did that woman do? This seems a little, like... Uh, Shut your pie hole! If you try to interfere with official police business, I'll start with you before I get to her! God, she's so fucking hot. What I would do to get a babe like that. Oh my god. Yeah, this giant model of a fucking character is able to downgrade their health if you, you know, run away or just stop fighting her. So I'm glad I took care of her quickly. Okay, well, let's get these people out of here. Are you all right? Thanks. Thanks. Are you all right? <laughs> Thanks. What are you thinking? Are you all right? Thank oh my God, those much. boots. Perfect. Uh, no way. Are you all right? Yeah. Thank you very much. All right. Is there anything we can give them in here for a weapon? Stun gun. Um. Here you have that. You're so kind. Oh. And these are all hold hands, gals. Alright. Let's make our way over to these people. Um. Okay, hunks of meat, I thought they were queens, my bad.
Can I talk to him? That motherfucker is gonna have to wait. Um. Cosmetic shop? Oh shit. Alright, let's see. Where is the bathroom? That is a cross. So let's go. Follow me. Seems like a pretty straightforward path. Forward. Forward. Pretty straightforward. Bathroom is where? Oh, it's over here. Fucking. I guess the map doesn't mark bathrooms, and I thought that random run sticker or whatever was one. Alright. Gotta make sure oh. everybody makes it, though. Nick's fast, that's good. Um, the ladies are doing well. Janet's a bit slow considering she has to carry around those boobs. Or those watermelons, I should say. Old Kathy's hand if I can. Maybe. There we go. Kelly, not Kathy. Ow. This is what happens when you give a whore a gun. Not a gun, a chainsaw. A weapon. Wait, how is she... Oh my god. Oh, that's cool. They, like, waited for their... They didn't leave us, but at the same time, they probably sh probably should have been helping her. Seriously. Hmm. I I hate this fucking roll. Um. like that went well um i'm gonna do the uh girl hunting right after this though less zombies out here. Huh, I guess it just depends on the time of day or something. I really do not want to spend much time around these cultists. Our 
Are we good? Are we good? Are we good? We are not good. Come on, Sally. Come on. No way. Sally, come on. Come on. Okay, I'm, I'm going. Hope everybody made it. Did they, Nick? Nick? Okay. Did they, are they one zombie, really? Let's go. All right, now I need to do girl hunting. My inventory looks fine, but another, um, chainsaw wouldn't hurt. Yeah, the chainsaw definitely kicks butt. Follow me. Let's see how much experience and whatnot I get for dragging all these gals around. Over there. Oh my god. Oh my god. Really? Alright, let's see. Woo, yeah, woo. Should be getting along with them, looking. No way. Poor Lilith. Oh, I leveled up quite a bit. Oh, I should save. I should definitely save. Not only because I did a job well done, but because, um... I have no idea how difficult this girl hunting and all that's going to be. Yeah, while well, he's sleeping. Pretty good. Not as good as my character in Saints Row 4 is, yeah, but still pretty fucking enthusiastic, you know? Yes, I am very much going to gosh darn continue. Alright. So I want to. Go and get those oranges, or orange juices, by the cultists. Hopefully not get grabbed. And then go to Wonderland Plaza, get another chainsaw, just for backup. Hmm. All these people. Jeez. Um... Yeah, I need to do girl hunting first. That's top priority. And then after, if I have time, the entrance plaza is like right next to the safe house. It's like right behind me. It's that door over there, that hallway, whatever. So, um, yeah. If I don't get grabbed by this giant crowd of people... Bam that ish. Our own ish. Hmm. Eh. Hmm. Don't let it get away. All right. I'm a woman. Let's go to the woman's bathroom women's bathroom. Um... 
Yes, this will lead me to where I need to be. Giant group of cultists here, but what's new? I'm fucking out of here. I'm fucking out of here. Alright, let's see. I think this is going pretty smoothly, I just don't know about um on those people in the entrance plaza because of how much this game loves to cramp people in cases together. Hey <sighs> Well shit, bad bitch. Fucking go be a bad bitch in the safe house. Fuck. I probably should have smushed my um weapons together. Um Where is she? Ow. <laughs> Exaggerated fucking. Uh, let's see if I can chainsaw her. Oh, yeah, that's much better. Come here! I'm coming for that ass! Ah! Ah! There we go. this anyway are you a reporter let go I won't run so let go you're hurting me how much do you already know have you called for help? Hold your horses, babe. I'm the one asking the questions here. What is Santa Cabeza, and how is it connected to all this? The zombies were created by you, not us. That's what Carlito wants you all to know. Who? If you want to interview someone, talk to Carlito. He has all the answers. You're talking about that guy that took pot shots at us with a sniper rifle, aren't you? Take me to him. No. Not now. He's injured. And in no mood to talk to anyone. I'll bring him to you once he's recovered. I can persuade him. I'm his little sister, after all. Why should I trust you to bring him to me? The zombies are a message from Carlito. He wanted people to know. Fine. Go. When will you be back? Tonight at midnight. Wait for us in the store next to the camera shop in the North Plaza. I'm Isabella, by the way. And I promise, I'll come back. I like how all the zombies disappear in the uh, cutscenes. And now they're back, whoa! Alright, it doesn't give me a save prompt. But this does give me time... ...to, um... 
do those other cases. I'm going to head over here and save. Because, you know, things are looking good right now. I want to make sure I don't uh, jinx it and whatnot. Uh, fat guy wants to have more food. Cool. Alright, well, it's a good thing I'm saving. Um... Hmm... Let me look at the map once more. Who's this? North Plaza. Oh, that's the um one I gotta do later. So yeah, I should head back to Wonderland Plaza and head through the um shortcut. While I'm there get another chainsaw. And yeah, I'll drink one of these orange juices so I can um get my uh, health back. Hmm. God, these books make this chainsaw like hella great. Hmm. Nope, this is the side with the chainsaw. No, I think this is over here. Getting eaten. Not liking it. Top over these, and yeah, less zombies. Cool. Um. Hmm. Bathrooms are down over here. Arrows giving me the long way, which I am not going to take. And, um, yeah, so far I think I've been doing really good. I haven't missed any survivors, just um, one dumb bitch that wanted to die. So, yeah, if she didn't want to die, I would have uh, had all the survivors so far. <laughs> That's me sneezing. Bless me, and sorry for, um, you know, killing your ears if I did. I'm probably gonna sneeze again. Called it. Um, cultist, not good. <sighs> Me and my colds when I record. Um, all right, there, uh, there's gonna be a lot of people over here, so I should get a whole bunch of points. E. Looks like 72 yards. I can blow his head off clean from here. Can I take a shot, Dad? Getting a headshot from here's no big deal, Jack. Think you can pull it off, Thomas? But Daddy, he ain't no zombie. He's just a man. Thomas! We're doing this to survive. You know that. Using a firearm for self-defense is our God-given right as Americans, Thomas. Come on, Thomas, shoot. Shoot him. Shoot him, Thomas! I said shoot him. Thomas. 
Now! What are you waiting for? Do it! Yeah, we got our Americans here, so, uh... This is gonna be a pain. Um... But I need to take care of them, obviously, if I'm gonna rescue all the survivors. Jump, jump, jump. Um... Yeah, I think I'm prepared. Let's see. Okay, defeated one. I wish I could help this Thomas guy. Because it's obvious in the cutscene he doesn't want to, you know, do this. But look, he just keeps shooting at you. What's up? Um, oh, wrong button. Really? Really? Sorry. But, you're running for me. Yeah, these are dress shoes. I'm much better off in the athletic shoes. Alright. Um. Wasn't there a guy over here I heard? Yeah, somebody's whining. Is he in here? Yeah, he is. <laughs> what are we doing here? Oh shit, it's um it's Bill. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for whatever the fuck that was for. Um. Alright, let's see. Antique lover. This is a sports shop. I'm gonna see what they have. Let's see what's here. Alright. Eh, pretty jocular, but, um, I don't like it as much All as right. the black and white one. They probably have different shoes, do they? Or do they have nothing? Looks like they had nothing. Alright. God. Look at those giant butts. Alright. Alright. Um, antique shop. Not a chance. Come on! Come on! <laughs> My god, I spent like an hour talking to this guy. Mm. Alright, I'm not.
not gonna mind carrying him, but I can't let this go. One of the juices? Or... Give him that. Alright. Glad he's excited. Man, you saved my life. Oh, I need to see. Woman didn't make it. I really owe you one. Can't talk to her until I get her friend. Oh my god. Thanks. All right, wait here. Mm. Actually, yeah, wait here. I'm going to jump down. Go. Better to have one of these clans than not to. I really need to go all the way back. Okay, looks like I'm playing telephone. Let's fucking go. What? Oh my god. Okay, yeah, just just run up there. Yeah, this this AI, well, I don't know, it's not really jam-packed, so I can't really say this AI is, doing, AI is doing better than, like, the other idiots, but, you know, at least she seems to be going for the marker. Well, she was. Seriously? Come on, not again, not again, not again. Okay, after these two reunite, the only obstacle will be getting past the cultists and just through to the door. Yeah, Kathy's Boutique was in um the second game, it was just uh, Kathy's Space, which is pretty cool. Nice little reference. I think they did that on purpose anyways. gonna hug and it's gonna be so cute. There we go. Fantastic. You are so kind. Sorry about that. Alright, these are both hold hands bitches, but I'm pretty sure Man, this guy actually, um, needs to be carried. It's alright, let's go. Come on!
and um, yeah, it looks like it's uh, smooth sailing from here on out. I mean, it looks pretty fucking uh, good. If the AIs want to come, let's see how slow this guy moves. Yeah, he's slow. Plus, when you carry them like this, it's not as annoying as holding hands, whereas that can be broken up just by turning left or right. So yeah, that'll be pretty good. Okay, wrong one. Follow me. Yeah, I don't like spamming Y. Like, come on, come on, follow me. Which you know helps with these AIs because, like, in the second game, a lot of noobs um spam that shit just to you know LOL make noise, and um. It gets annoying, so I kind of like figure it carries over on this game, even though it doesn't. Ow. Are there any other clean zombies around? No. Alright, I just hope none of these guys get, um... Yeah, thanks. Hope none of these guys get grabbed, um... on our way to the elevator. I'm sure they'll be fine, though. I'm just worried about the cultists, you know? They could be, like, right between us and the door. Now it looks like they'll be fine. Oh, fucking Jolie going right after him. Why is it? Oh my god, it's dark. It's like so dark. It's creepy. Alright, well, good thing I'm getting them back first. Tells me I'm gonna have to take care of all these zombies for them to make it to the elevator. These AIs love to get stuck. All right. Should be good. Me. Um. Follow me. Go. Oh, really? It takes it? Oh my god. I need to make sure he drops my fucking chainsaw then. I thought it would still have a hundred bullets because it does that in the second game. Can I give him the submachine? Oh. Didn't have it out. LOL. Alright. You learn anything new on this end? Santa Cabeza is a stronghold of the Central American drug trade. The professor here seems to think that the zombies are a byproduct of these drugs. So you're telling me what? That somebody spread a bunch of zombie drugs around Willamette? For what? 
What would making the dead come to life accomplish? They're terrorists. Don't try to explain their actions with logic. I've analyzed the drug in question, and I've reported my findings to the government. <coughs> that must be what set them off. <coughs> that they, they didn't want to be <coughs> exposed. <coughs> I've... I've told you everything I know! Now get me out of here! <coughs> Call for help and kill those creeps! <coughs> God, those hams. What's up with the old man? Why is he so freaked out? Oh wait, part of the story? Psh. Let's uh, talk to Ronald. I got Aaron. Uh. Good. I think Ronald hey. should always yes. count as, um, you know, humor. But all right, let's save again, and then we're gonna um, do the Isabella thing. Meet up with her and whatnot. We don't know if the old man's telling the truth. Is he? Is Santa Cabeza, in fact, just terrorist Call of Duty World at War? Just kidding, all Call of Duties are the same, I didn't need to specify. Well, the stories are a little different, but, um, the multiplayer is just map and gun DLC. Maybe skins, too, I don't know. I'll play it. Um, and then you have, like, the Battlefield hipsters that are like, Yeah, Call of Duty's all the same. I like Battlefield, because cause it's, you know, slowed down, therefore it's more realistic. And, um, the graphics are better, therefore it's, like, a whole different game, and you can get in tanks or something. It's completely legit. Like, that argument just shut me down. Okay, I am going to get my submachine gun. So creepy at night. I think I'm gonna get the toy sword. Surprised I haven't fell off that ledge I keep jumping over.
There we go. Now it's not so dark and menacing. Um, yeah, it looks like I have time. Maybe there's like hidden people or something. I don't know. Probably a hidden person or two. But, um... I think I should get another chainsaw. At the same time, I need to be careful with my, um... Food, because I only have two oranges. Orange juices. Um, much better than the sledgehammer. Hmm. All right, going to that gosh darn and and Isabella. I almost said Excella. Excella, Gione, stop right there. I kind of want to do a playthrough of like Resident Evil 5 and 4. I did one of Code Veronica. Wish I would have gotten an A rank. But curse those gosh darn cutscenes, and there was a part of the game I didn't quite know where to go. And then I have outbreak videos. I don't have the whole game, but you know I did good in the videos I posted. Um. Yeah, I guess I'll, uh, just wait for Isabella up over here. Oh, these power down at night, cool. Kinda like this lighting. It's a bit unique. It definitely makes things less intimidating. <clears throat> Um, <clears throat> oh, I need to set my arrow. All right. Isn't there like a gun store somewhere, too? come to the gun store like right away on the first day even though when I first played I didn't know about it until like my 10th playthrough. I um... I know you get like a boss fight. There's no survivor though. There's no like other survivor and stuff. Hmm. If I had beat Cletus and been able to save and whatnot. I um I would use this time to go and explore what that empty whatever blah 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 did, but I only have like fourteen in game minutes left, so might as well uh, you know, just wait here. Um Isabella told me to show up at the spot next to the camera shop in North Plaza at midnight. The clock's ticking. Ooh, mmm. Oh well, we can finally talk with Isabella and that gall darn guy that's been shooting me. What's his deal, yo? She. I wonder how dark it looks without the sword. Oh god. There's a zombie in here. Take this! Gaining on me. He's not gaining on me. Ah. Ah. I want this. Um. How much? How much can this? Oh, okay.
Go heck. Seriously? Seriously. Oh my god. <laughs> Fuck Toy Swords. Were you bitten? No. It was Carlito. I tried to talk him into coming, but it was no good. He, he doesn't trust anyone. He shot you? He didn't mean to. He was upset. I don't know what he'll do next. Hey. Hey. All right, looks like we got to take Isabella back to the safe house. So far, it just seems like that guy's a Dutch oven. And by Dutch oven, I mean douchebag, but, you know, same thing. But yeah, um... I'm gonna bring her back to the safe house, and then after that, that'll be the end of the part. Isabella! I'm so sorry! Is he gonna stand there? Big surprise AI is gonna stand there. <laughs> oh. The girl the people in the movie land. I will totes check that out. I'm going back through the movie, whatever. I'm not following the arrow. Okay, wrong turn. Thank God I checked the map. Really not hop over? Go. Shut the fuck up, Odin. Nobody cares about your bullshit. Come on, go. gonna suck for Kendall, he might die because, um, you know, all the cultists and the zombies and it's so packed. Wait. Okay. Wait, I didn't make the wrong turn originally. Follow me! Come on! Follow okay. me! Come on! Come on! Okay. Come on! Okay. Come on! Okay. Follow me! Okay. Come on! Come on! Follow me! Come on! Follow me! Follow me! Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh my God! Don't care. Yep, thanks for sucking my dick. Come on. Follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Come on. 
That have health already, shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. I just allowed myself to start following the arrow. Fine, whatever. Let's just fucking go. We're already by this door. Come on. Fucking shit. Just ran around this fucking plaza for nothing. No! Follow me! Come on! All right. Fucking shit, man. Oh, at least the convicts aren't out. Unless it's just not playing their music. Come on. Still, Kendall's gonna have to make it through fucking, um... The cultists and shit. This dumbass fucker won't stop calling the goddamn phone every two minutes. Every two in game minutes. Go. Otis is giving me a call, guys. Guess I'll stop what I'm doing and answer it. Come on. Stay on that phone for two minutes. Follow me. Come on. Come on. Follow me. Come on. Come on. Come on. Follow me. Come on. Oh, the cult is turned around. Is he coming or is he dead? Follow me. I'm guessing he's dead. Oh, he's coming. Follow me. Come on. Follow me. Follow me. Come on. Follow me. I really don't think it's worth letting Isabella die for some random idiot who wants to stand around and get killed. Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Follow me! Over there! Come on. Great, great, great. Yep, stand there aiming. Thanks. Thank God Isabella has a large amount of health. Fucking. Okay, let's just go. Son of a bitch. I'm clearing out the fucking way. I'm not letting this idiot kill himself again.
All right. Over there. Okay, zombies respawning. Imagine Isabella defected. That can happen if you uh, hit your survivors too much. Um. All right, now that we have a little breathing room, let's wait for that very important phone call. Do do do. Okay. Oh, okay, the call I already answered. Good. Good, I'm glad this is what you've been calling me for fucking 20 minutes about. Okay. Actually. Over there! I don't want to end up hitting either of these guys. Kendall made it. What is this? Oh yeah, she couldn't climb up. Who is that? Is she hurt? Yeah. You're looking at the bad guy's sister. Bad guy? The one who caused all this? That's right. Her asshole brother caused the zombie outbreak. His sister? What in the hell is going on here? I mean, does this have anything to do with that announcement earlier? I don't know much more than you at this point, okay? But he shot her, I can tell you that. And just so you know, that would be the same guy that shot you. What's he after? What's his ultimate goal? I don't know. But according to her, his plan isn't over. Not yet. Fine. Consider her in DHS custody. We'll question her when she wakes up. Kendall is not impressed. Huh, dog. Yo. Shit. Alright, I have time for a strange group, I think. But, um, I'll do that next time. For now, I'm gonna save. And call this a good part. <laughs> Click, 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 click.